Hello guys, welcome to the new video and the holidays are coming for January 1st of the new year and the raffle is underway, the new year's raffle, where you get an RTX 4070 Ti Aero OZ 12G graphics card. In order to participate in the prize draw, which will be held on January 1, 2024, you need to become a member of the channel with a minimum payment and follow me on Instagram. After a big drop in the BTC price from 44,700 to 40,000 and now the price has recovered to 42,345 and stabilized there, I think we are continuing in the bull run market. Better days are clearly looming for the crypto world, I informed you about that in the last video, that we are close to the bull run but you should still be very careful with investing in real coins. The real bull marker will start after the Bitcoin halving that is. April 23, 2024 There is also optimistic news from BlackRock as the largest investment fund. Very interesting coins for investment for me are Carlson, Caspa, Dinix and Nexa coins. for me they are favorites for the next bull run. All those coins can be mined and are thus easier and more accessible. Let me encourage you to leave a like and subscribe and join this channel to help make this channel even better. If you can, with a minimal overpayment, you can help this channel in these difficult days. I hope you are not bored but now is the time when coins are collected and sold later in the bull market. This video explains mining with RX 580 graphics card from AMD, which we do in Hive OS system with Carlson coin. Currently very popular coin with good price in to this bear market. The current price of BTC is around $42,965 with an upward trend. The price of Carlson coin is $0.059619 with a downward trend and a jump in the weight of the coin, you should collect coins and wait for a jump in the price of the coin. There are assumptions that Carlson can go up to 20x in the bull run and with a very low price there is a lot of room for growth. Carlson Network and the Carlson coin, KLS, is a new project that is forked from Caspa, KAS, with a modified proof-of-work algorithm called Carlson Hash that prevents KS ASICs from mining the coin. The project is still new and early and not much information is available, so you should treat with caution as always and if installing a local wallet in Node you should do it in a sandbox environment just to be on the safe side. The project has caught a lot of attention from crypto miners and a lot of GPU mining power is being sent over to mine KLS coins, 50 coins per block with 1 second block time. There are still no exchanges available with support for KLS, but you can mine with a local node and wallet and there are already pools supporting Carlson network mining popping up like Hero Miners. The latest version of LOL Miner 1.81 has added support for mining KLS coins with the new algorithm, 1% dev fee, and you can use the same settings you used for KAS mining on your GPUs. Below you can find a quick guide that we've prepared on how to set up a local Carlson network node and create a local wallet that you can mine KLS coins to if you are interested in getting started with mining. News from Coindesk US SEC denies Coinbase push for crypto regulations as unwarranted. The US exchange had formally petitioned the agency to start writing comprehensive crypto rules, but after careful consideration, the SEC said no. Coinbase has waited since 2022 for a response from the Securities and Exchange Commission on its formal petition to request tailored regulations for crypto, even seeking to force an answer through the courts, and the rejection has now arrived. The SEC says there's no reason to craft a new regime for crypto, and that it's already writing some targeted crypto rules and conducting enforcement actions under existing authorities, although two of the five commissioners disagree. Coinbase said it'll take the matter back to court. U.S. crypto exchange Coinbase petition to the Securities and Exchange Commission CC, to move it toward a system of tailored rules for digital assets was rejected by the regulator on Friday. Bitcoin at risk of snapping historic winning streak, but perfect storm brews for a strong 2024. Market participants expect interest rates to fall aggressively in the U.S., U.K. and Europe for the next couple of years, which is more beneficial for risky assets, OANDA's Craig Earlham said in an interview with Coindesk TV. Bitcoin's price cooled at $41,800, down 4% this week and on track to snap the first eight-week streak of gains since 2017. Investors moved a net $860 million of BTC to exchanges, signaling profit-taking, into the block noted. BTC to hit $75,000 early 2024 is US spot Bitcoin ETF approval and having narratives combine, WOO Network predicted. Bitcoin's BTC rally stalled putting it on track to snap a historic eight-week streak of gains as its price remained muted at around $42,000 as of Friday. 
The largest cryptocurrency by market cap recovered to $43,000 after Monday's 10% flash crash to $40,000 that flushed overenthusiastic leveraged bets on higher prices. A dovish Federal Reserve projecting rate cuts and the falling US dollar bolstered the recovery, but lost steam by Friday and BTC slipped back to $41,500. On-chain data indicates significant profit-taking behind the stalling prices. Bitcoin saw $860 million of net inflows into crypto exchanges during the week, the highest level since March, analytics firm into the block noted Friday. Moving assets to exchanges usually signals an intention to sell, indicating that many investors decided to take some profits after Bitcoin's 65% rally from $27,000 in October. If BTC were to finish the week below $43,800, it would end an eight-week streak of gains, the longest winning streak since April to June 2017, according to TradingView historical data. BTC was changing hands at around $42,000 at press time, down almost 4% since the start of the week. Experts predict BTC all-time high prices for next year. The recent dip in price is likely just a blip on the radar, as Bitcoin is primed for a strong 2024 with multiple investment narratives supporting rising prices, experts argued. I do think this kind of trading is normal, Craig Earlham, senior market analyst at OINDA, said in an interview with Coindesk TV on Friday. If you look at other asset classes, things don't move in straight lines. Market participants expect interest rates to fall aggressively in the US, UK and Europe for the next couple of years, which is more beneficial for risky assets compared to the past 18 months of rising rates, Erlam explained. The Dow Jones Industrial Average hitting an all-time high this week underscored the improvement in investors' risk appetite, he added. To take a breather and define a new range can be seen as a healthy sign, Anthony Rousseau, head of brokerage solutions at TradeStation, said in an email note. He said the Federal Reserve hinting at easing monetary policy and cutting rates next year injected a windfall of confidence in risk assets like crypto, but the more prevalent theme is still an increasingly anticipated U.S. regulatory approval for spot Bitcoin exchange-traded funds, ETFs, by BlackRock and others, and the fresh demand for BTC they would unleash. Meanwhile, long-term holders, or hodlers, who hold on to their assets for at least a year without moving, haven't started selling despite the short-term profit-taking, Rousseau noted, making Bitcoin's supply increasingly restricted. It's possible we have the perfect storm brewing for a strong 2024, with the possibility of closing in on all-time highs by the end of 2024, he said. All-time highs could come even sooner, crypto trading platform WOO Network predicted, as spot ETF listings in Bitcoin's upcoming halving in April, which will slash new BTC issuance by half, may create an enticing narrative combination. Finally, I can tell you that this RX 580 graphics card has shown excellent performance in Carlson coin mining and is one of the main contenders for the best graphics card for Carlson coins. Carlson is an easier coin to mine compared to Nexacoin and therefore the electricity consumption is less compared to Nexacoin. A hash rate of 205 mH and a consumption of 75 W is correct, but we should wait for the price of the coin to jump, but we should not forget that the weight of the coin will also jump. AMD graphics card that comes with Hynix memory, newer generation with excellent performance and low power consumption and excellent hash rate. We were able to tune Hivios to reduce power consumption while still maintaining a good hash rate. By the way, the RX 580 has the ability to enable it. Now I can leave you to watch a video and listen to fun music. I'm walking alone, the streets are empty. The only thing I can see is my own silhouette. I'm getting stronger, step by step. The clock is ticking, but there's no time for me. I've been flying from town to town, from London to Taiwan. I've been all around the globe, trying to protect your soul.
And